Team Jackson, what's happening? You know, after this morning's Instagram live chat where somebody actually brought this up and watching Queen Issa Rae's recent episode of Insecure, I think it's time we talk about something and that's open relationships. Apparently that's becoming a more popular topic, uh, something a lot of people are considering. So I wanna give my thoughts on it, all right, real quick. My thoughts of an open relationship, or at least my idea of an open relationship is something like a, a car that doesn't move or an airplane that doesn't fly or a boat that doesn't float. Like, I really don't get the fucking point. You know what I mean? Like a relationship is supposed to be something like a, a private party. It's, it's exclusive. It's uh, special because it's closed off to the public. Closed being the key word. But an open relationship is like a public private party, which of course means it's not private at all. So it's just a fucking party. You know what I mean? So an open relationship is not a relationship. It's just two people who are just open to dating whoever they want, which I thought meant they were single. At best, it's a long-term friends with benefits situation where the two of you are each other's main friend with benefits. You know, you can be uh, friends, of course you have a friendship, and you also are able to be intimate with this person, but you can be friends with whoever else you wanna be, as you should be able to in a relationship, and you can also be intimate with whoever else you want to be with. So you're just single, just call it single. You know what I mean? Like don't make it complicated. A relationship is two people who are together. An open relationship is two people who are just around each other, so they're with whoever the fuck they wanna be with. You know, I had a woman DM me about this recently, asked me how she, she should respond to this guy that was trying to sell her on an open relationship via text message. And he said, you know what? The odds are not in your favor. There are more eligible bachelorettes than there are eligible bachelors, which to an extent is true. But it was the second part that tripped me out because he also said that an open relationship is better than a traditional relationship where two people are cheating on each other, going behind each other's back, being snakish, lying, bringing home diseases and break babies or whatever else. That's also true, except it's the same as saying a car that doesn't move is better than a car that's wrecking. Like, yeah, it is, but it doesn't justify buying a car that doesn't fucking move, you know? And I know some people say, you know what? I want to be in a relationship, but I also want my freedom. Um, if you want your freedom, be single. A relationship is supposed to be two people who are okay with being cuffed to each other because that person that they're cuffed to is better than the freedom they had to be with anybody else. So to me now, just, just to me, an open relationship is essentially a what the fuck for ship because that's what comes to mind. Like, what are you doing it for? Y'all let me know your thoughts in the comments. And if you like free stuff, read my caption. I'll let y'all later. Peace.